All right, let's continue Yoshi's Crafted World if you're watching later on YouTube. Thanks for clicking. Hope you've been enjoying this one so far. Uh, I have some stuff to do here before I continue. The world's not 100%ed, so. Okay, let's just scavenger hunt stuff, so let's go. A cure, cure. Oh, I was like, what? <laughs> just, that just looks like a rock. No, no, no. I haven't done, um... I haven't done the base out of that other stage, but it's fine. Alright. Oh, what a long day. I might mix that up with Yoshi. But now we'll stick with uh, Hot Tub Yoshi still. I mean, would this be so cruel to put the thing I'm looking for whilst it's in motion? So let's see. The face is pretty subtle. Oh, there it is. Alright, got it. Straightforward. Another request. Mine cart with a flag. Waterfall cave. Okay. This game must be pretty long. I mean, once you do everything, it's. This is just the first stone. Check every spot. Still don't see anything. Ha <laughs> ha 
my flag. If it's at the end of the stage or something, I don't know. Oh, that cut it. There it is. All right. Mountain hot flip side. Okay, I thought it was. Description was strange. I haven't done this, so let's just use this as a chance to get it. at the end. Okay, well that was just place there, so I could do it. Oops. It's probably nothing. as much. Okay, one. Oh, no, it's gone. Oh, whatever. the axe. Alright, we're good. Keep playing. Okay, now just focus on running. I 
hear the doll. Oh, that. Nice. Got it. Alright. Just gotta get to the end now. Hopefully that's within the, uh, allotted time. all good. Just stirring my tea. I think it's often better to just leave that until I'm doing the scavenger hunts. Five buffalo. Flip side of the train. I don't have eggs. Please tell me I get egg. Oh crap. Okay, I got four, four eggs, five eggs. Don't care about the dogs. Where are the bulls? I think I said cows. <laughs> I definitely saw a few in the background, just can't remember if it was on this part or not. Just surprising. Okay, well, there's one. There's two. Sure, I don't miss it. I suppose I should check just in case it's a blind spot. more. 
Okay, I would imagine the last one's gonna be straightforward, hopefully. There you are. Tent. Mountain flip side. Okay. This is probably the last one. I remember seeing one, but... Guess we'll see. I should try checking high ground. I guess I just didn't notice it. Six crystal clusters. Okay. I think I know what they're talking about. I don't know if it's those things, but we'll see. I definitely say this is like one of the weirder songs. Okay, well that's one. Alright, so that's what they look like. How is Yoshi making all these noises? And his mouth is full. Another. Oh, 
all. No, it's fine. Rebound was intentional, I swear. so we can get the cosmetics pretty much. But that might have been something. Paying attention to the ceiling as well. There'd be one here for sure, but I haven't seen anything yet. Oh, there's one. Sneaky. This is going to require anything in motion. Wait, what was that? Nah, that's fine. Hmm, there's still one missing. At least it lets me backtrack, so that's nice. 
I missed it. a ceiling somewhere I missed. Okay, I thought for sure it would be down here. Is crystal. Pretty much the start here now. I still don't see it. Hmm. Trying to make sure that I don't miss any spot. What if it's actually here? Okay, it wouldn't be that. says on I Hmm. 
Okay, that's not that. I just want to be certain. One more. Can't imagine it'd be somewhat complicated. How's it not that? That looks like it is to me, but it's not. It would be targetable if it were. Can't look up. Very carefully. This is something really quickly chat. I hear some beeping. I just want to go quickly check it out. Give me like a minute. All right, I'll edit this out later, I think. <laughs> or if I don't, sorry. It's just, yeah, it was beeping. My fridge was beeping even though the, the door was closed. I don't know. Might have to look into that. But I got it to stop. It was bizarre. It sounded like an alarm. I was like, what's going on? I don't have an alarm. Okay, bat family, flip side of the waterfall cave. There's a lot of stuff for the scavenger hunt. It felt like I was gone for ages, but maybe I wasn't. I'll check it later. If it's within reason, then I'll keep it. Ah, all right. Yahoo! Oh, I haven't done this. Okay, I have to do this. I was like, wait a minute, this doesn't feel familiar. Because I haven't done it. try and get both goals done, but if I can't, that's fine. Okay, 
Okay, I've yet to see a bat. Thankfully, pretty lenient when it comes to time. Okay, there's one. I see it. Oh, it's just that. Okay, that one done. Just you now, Poochie time. I thought it was like a, a family of them, so it was multiple. Probably ah there. Whoops. Don't need that. Oh crap. Don't have much time left. Okay, hopefully the time was 3.30. the chair. I hope that's the last scavenger thing. Another, jeez, crystal blocks. All right, well, I've seen these around. I was actually throwing eggs at them already. Oh, there's one coin missing. No shit. All right, well, I should probably look for the coin. One coin, huh? Probably like a hidden one of these.
So this is gonna be a problem. That's all I missed. Alright, cool. Now we're fine. I guess I just didn't see the present in the background. Alright, well now I can rush through this stage a bit more. I'd like to get on top of that magnet. <laughs> really try. Not sure. Well, I think I do need it. It's more. The stage is going to end here. Yeah, there's a lot to do now that I look at it. But I've spent like the last almost hour. But still. Okay. Man, there's a lot of requests in this one. Surely this is the last one.
I guess we'll find out. I'm curious if this one's going to be like one that's in motion or... Down here. Please tell me that was the last scavenger thing. Dude, <laughs> it's like ten requests. Caramel, alright, well I know where those are, I've seen them. I'm gonna have to do the whole stage, aren't I? Probably. I don't know if this is more requests or less than the previous area. I feel like it's way more. I might be imagining it. I guess on the plus side I'll be able to afford all the costumes for the next area pretty much right away. Split across all the stages. <laughs> this is even worse. I thought it was just a stage, but I realized wait, I've seen that sign in the other stages too. Okay, well, I know where it is in this stage. Somewhere in the middle of the stage. 
There's all these cookie signs and then one of them is like that sign. confused for a sec because all the other ones are uh, put a magnet on. Somewhere around here. There it is. Uh, the other stage, I'm not sure. Is there a sign? Because this is a cave. Yahoo! I will swap Yoshi's only when this area is done. One Yoshi per area. I'm treating this like Yoshi's Island where once you reach the end of the area they would throw baby Mario to the next Yoshi so it's like I'm doing the same here. Except Baby Mara's absent, I guess. I really don't remember seeing a sign in this stage. So it's either going to be something very subtle, or like, I just didn't pay attention. Ah, there it is. Okay. Yeah, that was subtle. Is that it? That's a whole number, so... There we go! <laughs> Finally. Okay, choose Yoshi. New Yoshi time. I guess to be visually different, we'll go this one. And we gotta pick a costume now. <laughs> Do you like that one? I'm gonna go with that. Yahoo! To the Origami Gardens! Well, hello there, Yoshi, is it now? Mm-hmm. I've heard about you, my boy. What's that? Gathering gems, are we? Listen here, my boy. Listen well. Name's Crumples. 
I know all's worth knowing. Come here and have a wee peek at this. The gems ye after flew here, 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 and here. Told ya, I know all's worth knowing. It's up to you to decide in which order to gather. Sort it out, whipper schnapper. Okay. That's not linear, I guess. Welcome to the Origami Gardens. The path walks ahead, whichever direction tickles your fancy. Go ahead, whichever direction. Alright, well. New levels, finally. Oh, that's disappointing. I was expecting a new theme. I like the visuals of the stage, though. recorder I feel like <laughs> I don't know maybe I'm just overthinking it but I would imagine it would get old surely Lucky. Unlucky. What is it? Oh, it's an archway. Eggs, come here. Give eggs. That's a scavenger thing. Hmm. I was gonna say I should probably get more eggs. Sneaky. I'm glad I came back for eggs. That would have oh, that one would have bothered me a little. So would have gone through the stage and had coins missing. What? I'm glad I got the eggs. Okay. 
As long as the coin was acquired. After what happened, I had to ground pound now constantly. He oh, what is that in the background? That is probably um, a scavenger hunt item. Damn, the costume have tears. It's like this costume, I guess, because it's better ranked. It has extra health. Right. Okay, I guess there is a benefit to wearing stuff that is, like, deemed rarer. I don't know. Coin. Probably a Monty Mall. Uh, and a flower, apparently. All right, go back. Surprised this is not a thing. This looks very secretive. Those three coins I found are still one missing. That's probably a present. I haven't seen a present. I need to look in the background. Usually there's a present in all of these stages. Solves that red coin mystery. Now it's just the flower. <laughs> I 
Oh, this is the start of stage shit. Okay, we just have to find the flower. Yeah, I wonder where it is. But it won't be for a while, because it's what, like... Two-thirds of the way in. Just in case it's like a Monty Mole thing. The butterfly is, is definitely a, a scavenger thing. It has to be. Yeah, would have been the spot, but it's not. Hmm. I mean, this is around the part I would suspect. the end of the stage, shit. Where is it? It has to be before this part. I mean, I feel like I've gone through the whole stage now. Was it something that I just straight up missed? I thought I was pretty concise and... Didn't really miss anything. <laughs> Damn it, I thought that would be it. I need to check under these things. <laughs> Looks like there's still stuff to find. This is probably too far back. Yeah, this is the start of the level. Alright. 
consistent checks around these flower things. Like both under and over. That one I just got. It would have to be from this point forward. This is either something really simple or something just overlooked. That is so cool. <laughs> okay. Got it. Man. Alright. Now we can end the stage. Sneaky. Costumes! Are there 150 a pop now? I have enough. Dying it out. <laughs> A flower. Another flower. Just creamer. Squash. Flower pot. Resting yellow flower, okay. I mean, the mole one is gonna give me more health, I guess. Yahoo! I don't know, I kinda wish they were all the same. But I am a mound of dirt. That is the costume. I can do the B side right away. Do it. Yahoo! <laughs> you can see them hiding now. It's actually pretty funny. I do appreciate that little detail. Hey, where'd it go? Doggo! Okay. 
Is this all around? That's uh. We're fine. Hopefully it's 2.30. Oh, plenty of time. Okay. Monty Mole be gone. Yahoo. Oh. Defeat lots of Monty Moles. Okay. everything. I mean, cool minigame. That counts. <laughs> Fall into its doom. to get 75 of them, apparently. It's 75 of them. It's a lot. Get up. Damn it, it's gone. I'm hoping there's wiggle room. Present in the background, I have to get up. No! Oh no. I'm gonna die. Oh wait, there's no death. It's just. That's nice. I think I might have... Uh, oops. I'm gonna retry. <laughs> it kinda went to shit. <laughs> 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 
I was in control, but then, yeah, I was not. Good, good start. The whole story here is like there's an infestation of moles and we're exterminating them. So good, this is better now. Much more collected. Two. Oh, there was a flower. I'm gonna have to go back for it. Let's just focus on the goal first. Worth a lot. I mean, I got 75, I think that's the quota. Okay, so, I mean, a few flowers missed, but. Oh, no, wait, no flowers missed, just one. Because the flowers come from uh, Monty Mole targets. So, as long as I hit the big goal. Yeah, we're fine. Alright, so I just have to go back for the one flower. That's fine. Ah, those are the branching path that we're talking about. I like to think that Yoshi dressed up as a mole to infiltrate. And then just proceeds to obliterate them. Oh, 
that hammock is probably like, eh, maybe not. I'm thinking too much of scavenger hunt stuff. doing really well up until this point. Everything was going to plan. Oh no. Ugh, bad. It's alright. Okay, how am I supposed to get this? I have to drop down. I see the gate. That was... Yahoo! I mean, I'm killing time just by doing the thing. Some of these costumes definitely have crouching in mind. Treating this like I should be doing this properly. I've already done it. It's just, I want to see if I can do it better. feasible to get them all, you know? Oh, 
probably is. Oh my god. Okay, this is not the time to focus on that now. <laughs> as much as I want a perfect round, like, that's more priority. the last one again. I'm probably going to equal the skull. Seventy-eight again. Seventy-nine. Okay. Not eighty. Beat it by one. Could have done better. I tried. sides. Yahoo! Oh no, this is an auto scroll along where I have to find them. I just realized what this is. Well, once I have six eggs. Hey! I know it's there. Oh no. Got it. Jeez. That was concerning. Well, now I'm fine. <laughs> Moving Crouch looks so good. I'm infiltrating the moles. something tricky again. Can I hear it? There you go. That was easy. I guess I put that there not to soft it lucky if you choose the bottom path. I don't know why I'm intent on. <laughs> one of them's gonna be inside one of those, I betcha. I don't have to murder them. Well, 
Where is Lost Doggo? I was fully expecting that to be a doggo. So... This should be in the stage now! I wonder... Surely it's 4.30. Okay, good. <laughs> hey, Colin. Didn't see a notification. Oh, really? Uh, Twitch is a bit like that sometimes. No, I just finished work late. Gonna be a common thing on Mondays. Uh, flutter sign. Okay. How was the weekend? It was alright. I just did a lot of cleaning. A lot, a lot of cleaning. I was really tired on Sunday, but, uh, just caught up with my brothers. Yahoo! Had that inspection thing. How was it? Uh, you know, I just walked around the place, took photos, and then I brought up some of the stuff that I asked last time, and then they're like, oh, yeah, yeah, looking into it. <laughs> So, we'll see. What have I? Oh, I haven't done the B-side of this, okay. It's just the same every time. Wait, didn't I do- no, I've done this. I just need the thing. Yeah, I've done this. But yeah, knowing them, I probably won't hear from them for months. Okay. Oh, I don't have an egg. Did I find those four coins? I did, yeah. I went through the stage off stream and found them, and they were in the hidden cloud in an annoying spot. <laughs> Literally, the last spot I looked, it was just at the end of the stage, and it was in just a single spot. So. This game is very long, given 
just the the things you have to look for. Cabbages. Okay. Yeah, this stage is just about annihilating all the moles. I do find it funny I got a costume, so I'm like infiltrating the mole. The mole lair, and then just murdering them all. Yoshi has no mercy. like Twitch was being lazy with its notifications. It's been rather quiet today. <laughs> this costume's great. send notifications on my own. I, I can't, no. But, on Discord I've set it up so if you type exclamation notify in Discord in the server, the bot there notifies you when the stream is live, and it does it as long as my computer's on and the chatbot is working, it does it pretty much right away, like, without fail. It just pings you in Discord. Assuming you got Discord on your phone and all that stuff set up, but yeah. A few people use that over Twitch notifications because they can be a bit weird sometimes. The only other way I can send a notification is if I go offline and then back online again. Which sometimes is the case if I swap to the PS5 now. Not today. Okay, I only. St oh wow. It's, okay, it's been like a couple hours. It's okay. Like instead of fixing notifications, Twitch launched the feature where you, the chat member, can pay. So then. If you want me to really see a chat message, you can now pay for it. Although I think it's not available to me. It might be just available to partners. I don't know. I haven't checked. But I've seen the... I've watched a couple of streams during lunch today and the button was there. And both streamers are like, please do not ever use that feature. <laughs> just don't. It's another case of, yeah, most of the money goes to Amazon, again. By the looks of it, there's no way to disable it, it's just this thing. I hope I haven't missed one. I've... I think it's more useful in bigger chats when a lot of things are going on, but for something like this, it's just like... I've missed multiple cabbages. <laughs> it's just not... yeah. I've said this before, it's like... I appreciate the sentiment behind people wanting to, like, subscribe and all that sort of thing. 
and the bits and whatnot. I know it's part of the Twitch experience, but like I'm thankfully doing okay, you know? Job lets me live comfortably, and I say just save your money. Oh wait, oh! I don't have to get the ones I already got, that's interesting. That is good. Well, it's a rather... what's the word? Like... Ugh, I'm tired, but like... There's a word for it! <laughs> it's not idealistic, damn it. Ugh, I'm so tired. But I guess what I'm trying to convey is it's like not being in a position where I guess I'm being inauthentic, I don't know. And just asking for stuff. Yeah, it's almost midnight. Save. I don't see these cabbages. one here. No. It's a carrot. What? I like the music. The music in this one's good. I like the songs in this, but I think the, the, the recorder's just overused. And there seems to be less variety of music. That's the last one I noticed, so... Hmm. Uh... How have I still missed one? Hmm. bothering me that I can't think of this word. Like, what is wrong with me? I use this word all the time as well. I'm, I'm having a moment where it's just like, I'm gonna remember where it, when it's not gonna matter, and then it's gonna bother me. 
So like, uh, yeah. It doesn't matter. <laughs> I give up. I might remember. It's not I it's not like idealistic. That's not what I'm trying to convey. It's more just like a Trying to operate in a manner that's like transparent and honest, and sometimes I guess not having to do things that might like go against some of those principles of like not falling into advertising shit to people. There's a word for it, there's like. So that's what I'm trying to convey, but I just, I've lost the word. His brain is apparently dead. And just, I just feel like encouraging, encouraging people to press that button is just a form of me going against those principles. Even though, like, if I was to do, want to die, that's the cabbage! <laughs> Shit. Um, even if I were to do this, if I want to do this on a full-time basis ever, I would have to resort to that to some extent. Anyway. Jeez. I <laughs> saw it at the last second. Okay. What are you going to get me to do next? <laughs> Bottle? Ha oh, yeah. That's in the, gar the garden. Would I go full time? No. <laughs> I don't think that's ever going to be a reality. To, to do that, like, here's, here's the thing. There's a difference between being able to survive and living comfortably. So... You can get to a point where streaming can allow you to survive, pay your bills, and that's pretty much it. But then you can't do st stuff like enjoy going out to see a movie, for example, or hang out with friends if you'd like dive into that way too early. And you quickly get into the territory where like you have to just start chasing stuff like subscriptions and bits and all that stuff to get by. And it's something that I feel like it, it would just be a lot of stress and pressure that would just ultimately make me not like doing this anymore. So the other circumstance I would see myself doing this in if like somehow it naturally grew to the point where it's like, okay, well, you know, I'm large enough that I can, I don't, like some extreme circumstance would have to happen for me to not make ends meet as opposed to like, oh no, I really have to like, constantly be like, hey, 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 give me this, give me that. I just, I wouldn't want to do that. But even to reach that point, like, I just don't see it happening anytime soon. I just don't have the numbers for it. 
and I don't do what you should really be doing if you want to chase that, so there's that as well. A turnip. Okay. I saw a carrot, I didn't see a turnip. Something that would be nice if it would happen on its own, but I've been doing this for what, like, properly for five years, like in total for almost seven, and it's just, I feel like at this point, if it were to happen, there'd probably be signs of it by now, and I just haven't been led to believe that that will be the case. But you know what? I'm happy with what I got. Again, it's like, it's an outlet for me. It lets me chill. It lets me... ...create stuff without pressure. It's like, I, I don't really have to... ...be in a rush to make things. Just to make ends meet, if that makes sense. I'm not making content to survive. It's... I'm doing it because I enjoy it. So, it's nice in that regard. Slayed back, yeah, exactly. Again, if, if one day I see that, yeah, you know, it's within reason for me to do that, then I, I can definitely look into it more and do, I guess, more of an effort to try and make it happen. But, you know, one of the things that just gets in your head when you're a small streamer is statistics and numbers, not statistics, like data. I guess. And it's just like, to get to the, even to get to a partner, you have to get to, what's like 75 average viewers. And the problem Twitch has right now is like, it's very top heavy. And by that, I mean the majority of the audience is like in the only 1% of the total streams. It's like only the big streamers have the big audience, and then everything else is kind of dispersed amongst the smaller streamers. Where everyone has more or less an equal number of viewership, on average. And, I mean, it's the case. Like, I know a bunch of people that used to stream and, you know, very good streamers, but... In terms of average viewers, they just never went above a certain amount, and it's not because they were bad streamers or anything, it's just the reality of streaming right now. There's, there's so many people doing it. I still haven't seen- oh, there. Sneaky. So it's the same for me, it's like over the last five years, the average viewership has more or less been the same and hasn't moved. And same with the follower count. Not that the follower count really matters too much. So with those two things, it's just like, I don't believe like I can ever get to a point where I'll consider doing this on a full-time basis. So I'm happy for it to just be like what it is right now. I'm enjoying myself. Butterflies. Why do I see butterflies? Apparently in this stage, I don't remember- Oh, wait, yes I do. Okay. these things.
Hey, Colin, did I ever tell you the story of the, the PS4 remote? I feel like I did. <laughs> oh, that emotes. Good times we had. Yeah. Do I remember what game it happened in? Fall Guys. You know, it had a very good established meaning. thinking of. Hey! <laughs> oh my god. Alright, hold on. Eggs, please. Outside of that one, I don't remember where the other ones were, but I do remember seeing these things. I gotta collect more coins because the costumes are way more expensive now. for dinner. Uh, I just had some lamb shoulder. I bought a bunch of it and then just was leftovers mainly. Just had that with some veggies. Just quick because I had to, yeah. I still had work stuff to do. history check and you gotta make something with it. Oh. What were you thinking? I mean, there's a lot you can do with that. Where's this last butterfly? Ah, 
ha. There it is. Wait, there's still one more. Crap. It's probably on the other one. Maybe kiss of the ears. Oh yeah, that's good. My brother's been talking about just making soup with chicken. Just making stock with the bones later. Something I haven't ever bothered with. I just usually go store-bought stuff. What? I'm at the start of the stage. Where is it? You love soup. I'm a fan of Asian-style soups more than anything else. But with normal soups, like, I think... I mean, I like potato and leek, and there's like this shrimp soup that my dad used to do that was pretty good. Where's this butterfly? It's not those little ones. Ah, there it is. Jeez. I don't know why I'm doing this <laughs> so late at night. Just playing a, a f effectively playing Where's Wally? Or Where's Walder? At this hour. Just saying Where's Walder just feels weird to me. It just doesn't sound right. <laughs> Sounds like a made up name. Radish. Okay, flip side of Monty Mall. Damn, now I kind of want that soup. Never met a Waldo before. I've never heard of one. I mean, granted, it could be a name that's just gone out of fashion. Like, there are a lot of names that you don't hear as often. Like Cornelius, Agatha, Arthur. Just stuff that I guess you would associate with someone that's like in their 80s or something <laughs> by now. I mean, I'm sure those names still exist, but they're just nowhere near as widespread as they used to be. Radish. I don't remember seeing a radish. Names have gotten very unique. Yeah, I mean, there's nothing wrong with new names. So it's... I think the trend that just happens is like a popular TV show happens and then people name their kids after characters on those TV shows. And it's just... By the time those kids grow up, the, the TV show that they got those names from is kind of gone. And then there's alternate spelling of common names just to be different, but all that really causes is just, like, confusion. 
just means that child will have to explain. No, no, no. It's Will with a Y. And they order their coffee. <laughs> oh yes, who's this for? Oh, uh, it's for Will with a Y. Just having to do that legwork sounds exhausting. Lauren and Lauren. I've never heard of the second one, like L O A R A L O R A N. Jeez, I was reading that and I had to turn my head, and then brain went what? Where the fuck is this radish? <laughs> I probably missed it. There were two Laurens in your class. Interesting. I've never come across that. I've probably gone past the radish. I don't think I was paying enough attention. To go back to, like, the topic of doing stuff on a full-time basis, is stuff like getting, I guess, we, we call them the PS4 chat members. When we get PS4 chat members here, I just don't entertain it. I kind of just ignore them and they eventually leave or say something stupid. It's just one button away and then they leave. So I don't enable that shit. Which, I guess in the interest of, like, getting as many people to watch, probably not a good thing. Didn't expect that. Ah, it happens. I mean, every day, the day looms closer where it's like, shit, I need to look, consider getting moderators. But honestly, it's just like, every now and then you get it. Someone that's just like, hey, streamer, look at me, please, look at me, look at me. Hey, why aren't you looking at me? Fuck you then, I'm leaving. And it's just, that's it. <laughs> My chat member in Christ, I'm playing a game. I'm not looking at the chat 24-7. Give me at least, like, a minute to reply. You are nice in being high. Well, I do appreciate that. Thank you for making others feel welcome, despite how the first impression may be. I do appreciate that a lot. But if you notice that I don't respond to someone when they're behaving that way, I probably won't. That's just the fact. Because, I mean, early on I used to, and the case, generally speaking, is they just attract more of that, and it's not great in the long run. And I used to listen to a bunch of streamers talking about just you know, the things they regretted when they were small streamers, and a lot of larger streamers will say they regret not banning that one person in chat sooner. So. Because, yeah, it's like monkey see, monkey do. Not to, not to simplify it too much, but if too many people... If one person is acting that way, that means... The next person will probably think it's okay to act that way as well. 
and then you just end up with that. Don't need negativity. It's not just negativity, it's more just... I don't know if it's boredom or like that low of an attention span, but it's just like, I don't want that, man. I'm very fortunate in the fact that most people here... Okay. Pretty much everyone here, I don't want to say most people, everyone here is like chill and... We can have good conversation and stuff and it's great. I thought that was a carrot, it was the radish. It makes streaming just great. I, I like it. <laughs> that's why I kept missing it, because I was like, oh, that's a carrot. No, it's not a carrot, it's a radish. Yay! Okay, so now this is where I get the choice of branching off. I can go here, which looks like it's a desert. I'll give him the flowers anyway. That's still a desert. Or what's the alternative? Oh, this is nice. It's like uh I'll probably I will probably pick this one. picking this one. This one looks like it's gonna have a nice art style. Stitched together. But yeah, I, again, just quality over quantity. I prefer that. Just... I don't care, uh, like, to be the biggest streamer. That's not an aspiration of mine. What if I can just be in the point? What is going on? Oh! That's interesting. If I can be in a point where, like, the majority of people that hang out here are, are just... You know. <laughs> nice. That's all there is to it. Not assholes, And not just people bored and seeking attention, then I'll be happy with that. Mature, yeah. I didn't want to say that because the thing is, listen, we can be immature as well. <laughs> it's, we have our moments of immaturity here. I don't want to rule out being immature here because there are certain conversations we've had that I'd say are far from mature, but you know, generally speaking, it's People are respectful, and yeah, it's like, we can be serious if we have to be. Just go here. Oh. It's, an, it's another it's another stage where the song is just a recorder as as one of the instruments and that recorder is just getting louder and louder as the song keeps playing I think that's my only complaint about this game is like they they really should have gone a bit more easy on the recorder I see I see the cloud block behind it 
This is nice. Your daughter can't wait to play the recorder in school. The, yeah, report back when she starts learning and then you're having to hear it. <laughs> unless, unless she's really good, then you have no problems, but like... It's great that kids learn that instrument. It's a way to get them into music, but man, it's just... When you play that instrument incorrectly, it really pierces eardrums. <laughs> You're gonna have exedrine ready. <laughs> oh. I like the stage. I just, I just wish the music was more varied. That's all. I think the music is nice. It's not that the music isn't nice. I just feel like I'm hearing the same three songs. Just slightly different variations to them. Even though I'm sure that's probably not the case, I think the problem is, is purely the recorder. Like, when you compare it to, say, Yoshi's Island as a soundtrack, it just varies a lot more, that game. Get it. Oh, shit, now I'm going to have to redo the stage. I'm not going to play the Pikmin game. Uh, I want to try the first two. So those have come out, but there's a physical copy coming out next month, and it's just... I'm waiting for that because it's just cheaper. Again, just digital prices in Australia just suck. See how I go with, with those. If if I enjoy it, I'll look into the new one. But I'm very bad at any game that involves controlling multiple units. I just I've never been good at that stuff. Oh, I've missed a flower. Okay. It's alright, I'm gonna have to read Oh no, I have. That's that was the blue coin thing. Yeah. It's okay. playing the first one when it came out. That's, yeah, that's why I missed it, because it was a GameCube game and I just never had a GameCube. Nintendo messed up by not putting a DVD player in that console, otherwise I probably would have had one.
can you play Wii games on the Wii U? You can. It plays them pretty well. That's how I played uh, Wario Land Shake It. It was on the Wii U. It plays the discs. Oh, I'm out of eggs. Eggs! That's not fair. Alright. I need to come back into the stage anyway. Alright, I know it's on the left side now. I remember these things. These were in that... What were they called? They were called Gusties. Just wants to play a game for the Wii, but can't find your Wii, but the Wii U was cheaper. Oh, I think the reason... Because the Wii, I think the reason it's expensive, I might be wrong. Is just because it also plays GameCube games, it's like, that might be the reason. Or maybe it's just a case where it's just old enough now that it's just become this vintage thing. I don't know. I'm gonna have to repeat the stage anyway. I miss, I miss stuff. It's okay. Hey, hey, Gahami, what's up? How's it going? So what, blue coin and then... Did I get all the red coins? Let's see. I did not. <laughs> Let's see. The sta um, I think I miss a few like this. I'm gonna have to take a guess. But I, I would imagine that's where I've missed some. Awesome question mark blocks, like I'm sure. I missed stuff. Okay, just making sure there wasn't like a hidden area or something there. I was worried that I'd miss something at the start because I just fell down, but it doesn't seem to be the case. Oh, there's one. Look at that. Sneaky. I didn't notice that. See that? It's nice when people say hi. <laughs> the response is normal. I can't help but like poke fun at stuff. Oh, 
I thought there was like a lower area to this, but I don't know why I kept trying to recover. It wasn't meant to be. Oh. Wow. Okay, that's where I missed a whole bunch of them. What does that bring me to now, 16? I figured it, would, it was going to involve one of these pillow things. Checks. Yeah, I don't do that stuff anymore. I don't know, there's something about just that. It just... Afterwards, I don't feel right. <laughs> just... For those of you playing at home, that's Australia's version of Burger King. Oh my god, I messed it up again. No, I got it. Oh. I was gonna mess it up again. Okay. So what? How many now? No, I already got that red coin. Okay, so. Still four more to find. Looking forward to tomorrow. To, to, blah, to tomorrow. Not only will it be a shorter day, which is always good. <laughs> But I'm going to a German pub, so it's going to be good. Just with work, it's just because, you know. It's good to not always be about work, you know. Yeah, it should be good. Missing red coins. This aesthetic of it seeming like this is a kid's room. Oh, 
Sign all these lost coins. Alright, this is probably like a bad idea, but let's just see. Yeah, camera's already panning, telling me nope. Lost cords, stop. So it's just four red coins missing. Yeah! It's probably that down there. Hang on. <laughs> One! One missing. Oh my god, those things. that I'm still missing one coin. <laughs> this is the end of the stage, right? Okay, so... Hmm. This is gonna be fun. single red coin, where would you be? Other than looking for a date. You see that? That's, that's a joke. Because the word single can mean one, and it could mean that you're a red coin looking for a hot, hot red coin to pair with. I am hilarious. I'm just tired, chat. <laughs> Almost sign of the single red coin. This has become a game of just like it's going to be a, a, a question mark cloud in, in an awkward spot. I mean, unless it's at the start of the stage, I can't go back any further, so guess have one last look.
Because this happened to me multiple times, just one coin. something in the foreground or a cloud. Oh my god, I remember the world. Al altruism. Altruistic. Holy crap. <laughs> See? I remembered when it doesn't matter anymore. The word I was looking for earlier. Altruistic. Trying to do things that are altruistic. In nature. Jeez. Ugh, that was bothering me. Doesn't matter anymore. <laughs> and that's that's the word of the day. Oh man, that, that was driving me insane. No, it's not here. Okay. What does altruism mean? It's just, I guess, you try to operate in a manner that you have the concern and well-being of others accounted for, and to do things in, in an altruistic nature when it comes to, like, a streamer, I guess, is just... Not trying to sell people shit they don't need or not trying to get people to spend money when they shouldn't just to benefit you so you're caring more about the people on the other end doing okay before they think about you that's what i was trying to get at but i just could not remember the fucking word <laughs> just uh trying to do things altruistically but then the moment you you, you consider streaming as a full-time thing it's very hard to stick to those principles because to some degree you have to ask people to, to do stuff anyway that's that's it that's the word i was looking for i can't find this red coin it's probably at the starter stage Despite English being my second language, I'm not too bad at it. Like you wouldn't be able to tell. I do know I do know fancy words. Okay, I'm gonna look for it, because it's most likely at the start. Thank <laughs> you. 
Okay, I'm gonna look very closely here. Because I, I don't know any other place this could be. Being altruistic as you always asking me not to say the thing too much. I mean, that's just consideration. The thing is, once people start asking for that, it just stops being funny. It's on the equivalent of, like, telling a comedian, hey, act funny. Do it. better when that stuff comes out naturally. Hey, you're a teacher. Say something smart. Yeah, I mean, altruism is just... Think of just a character that sacrifices themselves for the greater good. That's basically altruism. When they operate in that manner and think about others more than themselves. They think about how actions are going to affect the collective and not the individual. drive me crazy. Again, it's just one coin. It It's a hundred percent one of these clouds. It's, it's hidden somewhere. There's a spot I just need to touch. And it's going to reveal a question mark cloud, and then that'll be the coin. It's not at the start. I just looked, so it's not that. I saw a video of some stranger did that to Adam Sandler. Said you're a comedian, do something funny. The guy was very rude about it. Yeah. I mean, that happens, it's just... It comes with the territory of putting yourself in the public's eye. It's just something you gotta learn to deal with. When it's rude, I don't think it's, it's like, uh, I don't think it's something you should entertain, really. It's just... I try to, like, give people the time, you know? If they give me time, I give them time. But when it comes to like, hey, say the funny line, it's just like, yeah, just let it happen naturally. It'll happen at some point. If it makes sense to do it in, at the time, sure. But like, the majority of the time, I'll just be like, oh yeah, 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 that's something I do.
<laughs> Your team lead called you. Oh, no, it's all good. I remembered the word I was looking for. Just out of nowhere. It didn't matter anymore, typically. Just the way I operate. What was it? Altruism. What I was trying to, like, convey is... Thinking about others' well-being before even thinking about asking them for money. Or, like, helping me out to, like, make ends meet to be a full-time streamer. And if you become a full-time streamer, you have to sort of give up those kind of principles where, you know... You don't want to ask people for stuff. You want people to take care of themselves before they... They give money, because, you know, I mean, times are fucking tough enough. You know, I do appreciate it a lot. It's just like, at the end of the day, just take care of yourself, please, before you even think of me. So that was what I was looking for. It's just... Not thinking about oneself and thinking about the collective and... The, I wouldn't say the greater good, but you know, that can be associated with it. Yeah, I mean, I said it before. English may have been my second language, but I know some fancy words. I just need to remember I'm what's most important. And now, right, I'm looking for a single red coin, but again, I'm, I'm in this thing where I just can't find this one red coin. to be some, like, uh-oh. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. Please. No. Gone. This is going to be a case where it's like a question mark cloud. Ugh, I might have to look this one up. I, I just don't want this to get to a position where I'm in the stage for like 40 minutes again, if not more. You never know, it could have been. Again, the recorder is just getting louder and louder. <laughs> it's just... Hey, what's taking so long? I haven't just found the coin yet. Now, if you weren't so busy with this red coin hunt, you might be able to pay attention to chat messages sooner and respond to them within 0.5 of a second. Yeah.
Ah, oh, it's just us. Okay. I'm pretty certain that uh, the chat member was like Australian as well. Just to put that out there. I had a hunch. I guess this is why I'm not popular in Australia. I'm losing my mind. Where is this going? <laughs> I, I feel like I've looked everywhere, but... Much like that other stage, it's going to be just this weird spot. I'm going to hate the answer to where it is. Yeah. Yeah. I imagine that would have been the case, Colin. <laughs> just based on, on that. But you never know. So, I've gone through the stage and I can't find this one red coin! <laughs> I, I have probably walked past it. I, I might leave it and just... Like, once again, just in my own, own time, hunt it down. As the recorder in the background is getting loud. Definitely convinced this is a this is a question mark. I'm gonna have one last look at it. But if I can't find it, that's it. We'll just we just leave it for now. We got other stages we can do. As much as I want to get this done. I I just don't think <laughs> I feel like I would have found it by now. So it's 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 in some annoying single spot, much like that other stage. I bet someone that's played this game is just screaming internally right now. Just, they know where it is. I've probably walked past it like 50 times. Okay. Now I need a neck. Oh. Egg. Ugh, eggs. Here we go. Please, please tell me that's it. I don't know where else it would be if it wasn't this. Ah, it's not it. It's not it. Where is, where is it? Where is it? I've, I've looked everywhere. I feel like I've looked everywhere. I thought that- I really thought that was it. It's like, yeah, I finally got it. Persistence. 
Nope. If I was still living at home, I would go into the other room and go get a recorder. Because we used to have one. And I'd just start playing it loud. Obnoxiously loud. And just replicate how it feels to me right now every time I hear it. I'm losing, I'm losing my mind. <laughs> it's just one. It's the one time. I've, I've looked everywhere. Back from a blood draw? What, like figuratively or literally? Metaphorically, maybe? Literally? Ah. I'm just losing my mind, just looking for a single red coin. Tired. Just... Start of the week. It's been a quiet night, but it's also been a very not quiet night. <laughs> I don't know how that's humanly possible, but it does, it does happen. Where is this coin? I'm walking to the end of the stage, so, you know, if I don't find it within the allotted walk, then that's it. I'm ending the stage. Just... I feel like I've been so thorough with this. And yet... I enjoy looking at the stage though, it is quite nice. <laughs> this, this recorder music. I have crawled through every last bit of this stage. I don't I don't understand where it would be. The only the only thing I can think of is like somehow it's at the start. 
But every other part of the stage, I went through it. I mean, I, all right. It's just one coin. I'm just going to check the start before that drop. That's it. That's the only other spot I, f I figure it could be. But see, the only... Oh no, like... I say that I've looked everywhere, but I feel like I've looked everywhere. Okay, this is what this... I'll show you what, what this feels to me. Hold on. That's the button. Alright. <laughs> That's... As I'm not finding the coin, it just feels like that. In my ears. As nice as the music gets, it's just that recorder. So if it's not here, this... Why haven't you found the coin yet? Alright, this is the only area I'm looking in. Oh, bitch. I swear. There it is! <laughs> Alright, I'm going to the end of the stage. Text turn for a while was the Yoshi tongue noise. That's a good one. It's like 20 minutes of my life I'm not getting back. Resisting the urge to just try and make the sound of a recorder with with my voice, but I know I won't, I'll fail miserably. So it's like I don't want it to become a thing, or it's a sound effect that people will like just use for years. Yeah, just know that I'm I'm resisting the urge. Yeah, I've got to reapply the costume because I lost it. Just let me get to the end of the stage. Hey, Steve. Yeah. Playing Yoshi to have a chill time. This game and it's... Finding everything can be tricky. Cool game. I like it. Yeah. <laughs> 
Red Snow Bridge. Yeah, but it's just one of those things that it's, uh... It's something you can't expect to happen every stream. <laughs> Not my normal. All right, there we go. Worth it, <laughs> just to get. Okay, now I can move on. I'll do this. Well, I mean, Yoshi games are always a good time. I've always liked them. Ever since Yoshi's Island for the Super Nintendo. Much like Kirby games. Yahoo! Hold on. I'm gonna put... A costume on. Have I played the Cosmic Shake? I have not. Oh wait, not that. It's costume, not Yoshi. I'll we'll still stick to this one. I just want- I don't know why it unequips the costume if you lose it. Seems strange, but okay. And where was it? It was this one. so I can sneak up on the moles. It's not a thing, but I like to think that Yoshi disguised as a mole just so could infiltrate the base and destroy them all. Yahoo! I mean, look at this. Inconspicuous looking. Try and do this as quick as I can so then hopefully the next stage isn't gonna have this recorder as an instrument. It's a shame these games only get put on Switch. I mean, to some degree, but it's just. That's why Nintendo sells consoles. It's like you buy them so you can experience games you can't get anywhere else. Every console has that to some extent. They're being more open about it. Like now you got them on mobile, which whilst not... Not a huge deal to some, it's just... Never would have thought they'd do that, ever. Seeing the behind the scenes of like the stage, just seeing what the stuff is made out of, or sometimes just seeing enemies disguising themselves as objects and you can see them in this side of the stage. It's a nice touch. And you also learn about hidden areas. Don't like it on the root platform. Everything should get ported to PC. Yeah, that's just like a PC person talking, pretty much. Sometimes things don't translate well to PC, like... There are things that are designed with controller in mind, and they're just better experiences with controller. So when people talk about PC, like... 
that mindset comes from someone that primarily uses keyboard and mouse and would hate to use a controller. Not always, but generally the case. But that's changing, like, I know that controller on a PC... More... I guess because they're being developed as a console game first, they're just becoming more accessible. You use a controller all the time on PC. Oh, that's good. It's about the freedom to use what you want on PC. Oh, no, for sure, but I guess... The reason some of these games don't get ported over is, like, they don't want to. It's like... There's just a controller. And they don't want to think about, oh, what if someone is using a mouse or keyboard controls and do we need to, like, make that experience better? Like, on the topic of Dark Souls, when that game first came out on PC, it still had Xbox controller stuff appearing. Like, they did not give a crap about keyboard and mouse and people got so annoyed. Um, this is on the Switch, yeah. This is the Switch's Yoshi game. Came out... 2019. It still has the Xbox controller key bindings. Okay, that's funny. But yeah, like, people would want the freedom to... ...be able to use a keyboard and mouse, and it's just... The reason some of these games never make it to PC is just because developers don't want to think about that. They design it with a controller in mind, and that's the way, like, the experience is set, and they don't want to have to go, okay, well, we need to make this work pretty well for, uh, keyboard and mouse. Some choose to not care and just release it anyway, but there are others that I feel like, oh, the experience is lessened if you don't provide, like, the, the option. It's annoying because you use a PS5 controller and... You get used to converting the key bindings ahead. I got an Xbox controller specifically for that, just because the on-screen prompts sometimes. They got a bit... a, a bit much. That's it, right? I, got, I did this, yeah. We're good. This is a nice stage. Look at this. That's <laughs> the big... Oh, they don't turn into the big eggs, boo! I was, I was expecting the gigantic eggs. Damn, that's... Chat, I swear. I, I really am enjoying the game. I like it. I think the art style is so nice, and it's a Yoshi game. It makes me happy on a level that, yeah, it's just, I don't know what I'm trying to say, but I guess what I'm trying to say is it just kills me when I start a stage and then it's this, it's this song again. <laughs> the recorder. Like, please, this, this is the only flaw of this game, I think, is its soundtrack is not expansive. I didn't mind the song the first few times, but now it's getting to the point where I'm just... Oh, that instrument is, is just getting louder and louder every time I hear it. Mm -hmm. 
fucked up, but I want the RA soundtrack. I mean, you wouldn't get the sound effects. I wish I could. I could just mute the audio on my end and just play something else. It's not like the audio is required for gameplay. I don't, I don't need audio cues. If it really bothered me that much, but... It's alright, it's part of the experience. I have to experience it. The rest of the sound effects and everything make me happy. It's just, I wish there was more variety to this game's soundtrack. Because it's either it's this song, or it's like a rendition of the song that's similar. Like, not quite the same. It might have the same melody, but then using different instruments. Or it might be just another song that uses a recorder. Like, that's pretty much this game's soundtrack. And... I mean, it's just... I wish, I wish it was more varied. That's all. Aww. Bye, Poochie. Oh, wait. For everything else being so nice and detailed, I'm just surprised the soundtrack is this, I wouldn't say shallow, but just, yeah, not, not much variety. This would get old after 10 minutes. Dude, imagine doing the same stage for 40 minutes, looking for a single red coin. And then the next stage you do, the song starts again. It's pretty much what happened just now. Nah, fuck that. Yeah. Look, again, I, I still like the game. I, I like the art style. It's making me happy. It's like bringing this feelings of nostalgia. So just The Yoshi games always make me happy. When I'm playing through a stage that I haven't played before, it becomes white noise to some degree. It's mainly when I'm trying to find everything and trying to 100% it. That's when, like, I keep saying the recorder get, gets louder. That's what I mean by it, is like, oh, I start noticing that I'm playing this song again. Oh, I start noticing that the recorder's in the background. Look at Yoshi the glutton. Uh, hmm. Okay, I thought I messed it up, I didn't. And to be fair, those those things would be nice. I like those. The SpongeBob games have issues like that. I haven't played any of them. I heard Battle for Bikini Bottom was really good back in the day. Like, as far as, um... Like, a game that is based off a TV show could be. Much like the Simpsons games, like Hit and Run, they were pretty good too. You wanna to talk about Salt? That That's a game that I'm afraid to play again. The Rehydrator Edition is pretty good for a basic platformer. I've heard, yeah. I, I didn't really, uh... I mean, I watched some Spongebob, but I didn't watch a lot of it. So my nostalgia for that show isn't as high as some who would have, uh... grown up with it. Like, yeah. I grew up with The Simpsons. But I guess these days I'd probably try a Spongebob game before a Simpsons game. Oh, 
Oh my god. I almost missed it. Fudge! <laughs> That's fine. <laughs> this, game, this game is so nice. I mean, it's just so wholesome. How can you not like what's going on? Uh, I've missed four red coins. Oh, where are these red coins? Where are these red coins? Oh, you know what? I think I know where they are. Believe it or not. I think I know what I'm looking for. Every stage has a present in the background that has a red coin or two in it. I did not get one in this stage, so... I believe that's what I'm looking for. Okay. I was checking. Just gotta look in the background. Wait, what's this? Oh no, that's, that's where I came from. I did get that. Oh no! I can't go back. I don't think so. Maybe I can, hang on. Okay, it's fine. Seeing it. Hold on. There we go. Music is getting louder. is getting louder. Yeah, I don't see a present. Hmm. Well, uh... I don't know what to say. This is another case where I feel like I've looked everywhere. Where is it? Cool. I've found another stage where I have to hunt down the red coins. Even good soundtracks like Crash Bandicoot's get on your nose when you're trying to hunt collectibles. Don't know how I'm able to do this one. Just honestly, nostalgia is carrying this quite a lot. There was only one donut in the background, one donut in the background, where... How far back? I'll have a look, I'm willing to try. Oh, this is the start of the stage, right? 
Further ahead. Okay, I'll look. Yeah, I mean, Crash Bandicoot 1. Hey, that, that got to me. I had to mute, I had to mute the audio of that game. And I was trying to complete the plat. What, here? I see a donut. Doesn't look like you can target it. Thought I might be one because, yeah, I was the only one. Yeah, no, it's good. It's a good thing to look out for. If that is possible, that one could be one of the things that we have to collect. I wouldn't be surprised. At least this is not diff- it's not difficult, it's just backtracking. I'm gonna aim under these bridges just in case there's like a hidden... Oh shit. I mean, background elements, it's, yeah, generally speaking, they give standard coins. But some of them will have enemies hidden, they'll have red coins. So I figured it's still worth a shot. I got the ones here. being a little bit desperate here. Just shooting random eggs hoping that there's like a hidden cloud or something under. What about the cupcake? What cupcake? Oh, the ones that Poochie eats? Yeah, you can't shoot them. I did go on- I did go on top of it. Like, I've done this. You... <laughs> I hadn't done that one. I did the other one back there. Alright, there it is. The one cupcake I didn't jump on top of. Yeah, the one- the one- the one before. The one before, I definitely did, because I remember getting it, so I was demonstrating, yeah, I've, I've gone up on these, and then, of course, that one I hadn't. <laughs> <Jeez. laughs> Alright, I'm just stretching. Uh, that was probably, like, a really unexpected sound for some of you here. I, I apologize. I'll... Sounds of an old man stretching. Jeez. Okay, find the pups. This is more straightforward. Yeah, of course it was at the very end. It always is. It always is. Wanna hear a cool song? <laughs> oh, man. Mm. 
music is getting louder. Music is loud as fuck. Music is getting loud. I need eggs. Right, I'll just re retry. <laughs> yeah, I think that's just that's just this this one thing about this game. Everything else is so nice. I think this song would be fine if it didn't have the recorder. I could listen to the same the same melody and be fine with it. The problem is, <laughs> does it is did any music that uses the recorder to like a a major extent? Unironically, I mean, just I feel like it's one of those instruments that it it's when used sparingly, it's fine. Surely they knew this was shit music. I mean, I think there's nothing wrong with it. It's just... This is just my preference. I just don't like it. Maybe they just wanted to go for like an innocent kind of childhood vibe, which it does. That's what it is. Oh, what? There's another... How do I get up there? Oh. Came down. Alright, it's fine. Hear the dog. Oh, there you are. Look at that. Such a greedy little thing. Am I doing the last level in a rust? Yeah. Each stage you have the front side and then the back side. The back side you can see what things are crafted out of, and you have to find the dogs in in this version of the stage. And you have to do it quickly. So you just play a mirror version of the stage, pretty much. But you get to see the nice detail of just the arts and craft, what they're made out of, and uh, sometimes just little hidden details. It's a, It's a cool concept, like, I really do like it. And if you missed out on secrets, it'll show you, oh, this place is actually hollowed out. I can see that now. Stuff like that. So it's, it's cool in that way. It's visually nice, but also it has a purpose of showing you, oh, this is where secrets are, are without explicitly pointing them out at the time. Let fate decide. If this is the same song again, we're not doing this stage. Yeah. 
I mean, it's technically the same song, but it doesn't have the recorder. So this one falls more into the back. Oh! That's cool. I'm worried that I missed a red coin. I'm retrying. But at least it's a more laid back version. But this is what I mean, it's like, even though this is a different song, it still feels like the same song. Yeah, it's, it's much more pleasant to listen to. Like, I, I can I can work with this. I could listen to this on loop. Never mind. <laughs> That's the recorder again. <laughs> I mean, it has it has it to a lesser extent. <laughs> now we won't. Now we won't be able to play the rest of this game without noticing the fucking recorder. I mean, at least it comes in less often. That's, that's, that's the positive I'll say about it. Jeez. I've invented official lyrics to the song, and the lyrics are, Music is getting louder. Music is getting louder. Music is getting louder. Oh my god, it's so fucking loud. That's only when the recorder part comes in. <laughs> it starts so nice and then fuck your ears, recorder. Pretty much, yeah. <laughs> Music is getting found Music is getting louder. Oh my god, it's so fucking loud right now. to the fucking recorder! <laughs> I don't know. I didn't know what to say that. That's what it's like. It's just, you know, so quiet whispering in your ears. And then the recorder comes in. <laughs> oh dear. This microphone, I'll tell you what, like, it does an amazing job at just... Making sure that your ears didn't get destroyed by me just yelling like an idiot. You have no idea. Like, it's it just amazing mic. Best upgrade that I did last year. Get the rope, get the rope. Oh, no, I didn't get the rope. Please tell me I can. Come on, Yoshi. Hang in there. Hang in there. Ah. Nah. 
It's okay. I mean, I kind of had to go back anyway. That's why. I've never been able to get used to that sound. Music's getting pretty fucking loud. Music is getting louder. Music is getting louder. Music is getting louder. Oh my god, it's so fucking loud right now. Listen to the sound! <laughs> I can't do it. Oh, <laughs> uh, fuck. I need to go to bed. of my life right now. I'm going to have to throw some ear bleach before bed. I'm not sure what that's going to involve to do that, but probably. Oh. Stardew Valley soundtrack. That's a good soundtrack. I've been playing Tunic. That has a really good soundtrack. I need a new earworm. Oh no. The last earworm I had, I only just recently got rid of. And I, I, I blame one of the biggest streamers I watch, uh, Vinny. Well, you don't know him, he's Vine Source, but... One of his regulars got footage from, like, a an old Spanish TV show. Where, um, they had some clown dancing to some music. The song was such a fucking earworm. And, you know, of course, because it was, like, South American, the clown knew how to fucking dance. <laughs> so, it's just... The song, I, I reckon, on a daily basis would just pop into my head, because it was just that catchy. Tell you what, at the end of the stream I'll play it, but I'm not taking credit for it, like, that's that's just Vinny's bit. But, yeah, he got that song stuck in my head. 
Did I get all the coins? No, I failed. You still have the Chicken Yodel song pop up in your head once in a while. See, there you go, I was talking about that one recently. That one I can take credit for. Oh my god, I'm missing four coins again. <laughs> I'm missing four coins again. Why is this becoming a common occurrence? Okay, pal, I, I have to get these four coins. I feel like there's always one question mark cloud that's just in an annoying spot. It seems to be the thing. Oh, wait, we get more costumes. Hold on. Yes. Give me all the costumes. The sequence looks so cool. I love this visually. That's a nice one. That one's just lazy. <laughs> Cupcake. Alright, at the very least, I will apply the cupcake. I think that fits this one perfectly. I can imagine this Yoshi being called Cupcake. Yeah, this game is really good at doing that. Ah, oh, and when you duck, look, all the, what I love about these costumes is just the attention to detail in some of them. When you duck, you just look like the object. It's a nice touch. It's soft, yeah. I mean, it's it's a crafted world, so it's probably made out of some fabric. Oh boy. It's okay. I'm not gonna do it. But you know, you know what? What I'm thinking. You know the lyrics to the song I made up. Extreme mode was <laughs> not, not the first time. Should have seen when I was playing Donkey Kong Country 2. Forgot what stage it was, but it was causing me grief, and I made up a song to the stage. All right, well, all right, that's done. Um, excellent. That's it. I just gotta end the stage now. We're good. Good. I'm not gonna spend 40 minutes listening to this song. Music is getting louder. Music is getting louder. 
Music is getting well done. Oh my god, it's so fucking loud right now. <laughs> I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna do it, it's okay. But now you won't be able to think of this song without hearing those lyrics. Costume's great, I love it. You attempted the duff off this way and get this, but think you'll save yourself a headache. It's a shame because the game is great. Like everything about it is, is I think really nice. I mean, is it the best Yoshi game? No, but it's I think the visual style is so nice and if you ever played any of the other Yoshi games, it'll definitely bring a good sense of nostalgia. It'll make you happy, for sure. It's just... <laughs> I mean... I guess if you're not 100% in the game, you won't have the problem I'm having right now. You've never played a Yoshi game? You should try Yoshi's Island. Go back to the Super Nintendo game and play that. And then, I guess the one where this formula became what it is, and it's tried and true, was uh, Yoshi's Story on the Nintendo 64. But Yoshi's Island is, is still very good in its own right. It's just a little different to this. Okay, one last thing to do for this stage, and then we're good. Which is the base side, so I'm kind of interested to see it. They're fun games. They can have little tricky elements, but they're very forgiving. If you're a PlayStation kid, never had Nintendo growing up. Yeah, that's fair. Apart from the way that that was for Wii Sports exclusively, if that makes sense. A lot of people had to the Wii for that reason. Oh yeah, we're doing the reverse now. This is... So we're starting with this. That, that is a retry. Well, at the very least, you know that this will probably end up on the end of your highlights. The time the music got too loud. What are you doing over there? I need an egg. Yeah, I mean, for me, I did have a PlayStation as well, but Nintendo consoles have always been part of my gaming collection. I'm trying to think. So, like, I think... The Nintendo 64 and GameCube, there was a bit of a break, because I didn't have either of those two consoles. But then, from the Wii onwards, um, yeah. I had... 
Let's see. I didn't have a Game Boy Advance. I didn't have a 64, and I didn't have a GameCube. Those were the consoles I didn't have at the time of their release. Oh, and the Wii U. Uh, I mean, I, I guess I got this Wii U at the time when it was still technically active, so... You could say that I guess I had a Wii U, but I didn't really play the, the library to the full extent. There's a bunch of games I have that are still only for the Wii U, and... I mean, they're worth playing. I'll probably check them out at some point. But most of the games have been ported over to the Switch. When I run the plats again, I have to have this playing. The worst of both worlds. <laughs> yeah, I mean, look. For me to play Crash Bandicoot again, it's gonna be a very long time. I'd be doing it because pretty much it would be a large percentage of the audience would have missed out when I played it the first time. That's pretty much it. But it, I, me playing it a second time, it's not going to be the same experience as the first time. Like, It's just not going to be. We won't get that insanity. Purely because one, I'll be more, I'll be more conscious about it. But two, it's just Twitch is a different place. Like you can't just play copyright copyrighted music for a, not even a joke. So some of the stuff I did, it's just it's not gonna happen. And I feel like knowing what I know now, it's there's mental preparation, so I don't think I'll get that heartbroken. I'll get I'll get annoyed, that's inevitable, for sure. But it's just not gonna be to the extent where it was the first time. I was tired. It was the perfect storm of me being tired, having a long day, and then just things not going my way in a game, and it wasn't my fault. It was just the physics in that game were jank. So, it was like a perfect storm. And then a lot of people just happened to be on the stream that night, so it was like, I felt like I had to, I had to follow through. Because people had been watching me for hours trying to do the damn level. Sunken cost fallacy. Of the highest order. I didn't find one of the dogs. I'll just do the stage again. It'll happen again one day, it's just... It, it'll be at a point in time where I feel like it's for a larger audience and then I can justify it in my brain going Okay, a lot of people missed out on that. A lot of people like Crash Bandicoot. I'll play it <laughs> Even though I know what's going to happen. I know what's going to happen To be fair just with the first one When I got to Crash 3, Crash 3 was Crash 3. That's comfortable like, even when things got difficult, I pushed through it and didn't really struggle because, yeah, that game, I did everything. I gotta do it on PC. Uh, I'll do it on the PS5 because I can do 1440p with it. And the PS5 does 60 FPS as well. Crap. But I'm not gonna buy it on PC just to do 60 FPS. Unfortunately, this computer has kind of seen its... <sighs> its time now. Within the next year, I'll definitely upgrade. In fact, I was looking into it a little bit today, just what I guess the standard is. And I think I need to wait just a little bit longer because... Not to get too technical, but there's a new video codec that you can encode to that... It makes things look better for streaming. And... It means you can stream at 4K, but it doesn't use as much as of the bandwidth. It's really good. So only newer graphics cards support that properly. Um, and it's only first generation of that stuff, so... I feel like giving it, like, another six months, it should be okay. But 
but uh, long story short, I want to get a computer that just lets me do, like, at the very least, 1440p easily, if not 4K. Wait, the PlayStation version was harder because of 30 FPS? Wait, the, the PlayStation version is capped at 30, even on PS5? I don't know that. Yeah, eh, it's fine. I'll be alright. They didn't upgrade it, that's a shame. I kind of assumed, because it was like part of that bundle of games you could get for the PS5. Yeah, just Activision Blizzard's thing, so no, that's fair. I just, uh, unless the game is, is dirt cheap, I just don't want to buy it again on PC, that's all. Like, I already have it. <laughs> I have it twice, I have it on PlayStation and I have it on the Switch. Yeah, I mean, that's that's really dumb. There shouldn't be too much of a reason why they can't just unlock 60 FPS mode. But, okay. I mean, to be fair, there are... It's not just an Activision thing. There are a lot of other PS4 games that are still locked at that on PS5 mode. Like, Bloodborne comes to mind, a game that I've been just waiting for them to do a 60 FPS upgrade. Because I've been interested in that game, but it's just... I just... I'm holding out, man. Just hoping they do do that. Yeah, I don't think it's a matter of a technical reason that they can't. I think they just choose not to. I mean, why focus efforts on something that isn't a live service game, but I think that's pretty much their mentality at this point. funny something that i just i realized um just the other night i'm kind of playing games from the 2017 to 2019 era a second time three minutes 30 okay like breath of the wild for example was one and then i do want to do tropical freeze but I feel like there's a bunch of other games that are pretty quick that I should just replay anyway, because they were good. Like, stuff that people never got to see. Celeste, for example. Hollow Knight. Stuff that I don't have the VODs for anymore. Hollow Knight I definitely want to do because I want to do it before uh, Silk Song comes out. But it's almost to the point like I'm recreating the streams from 2017 to 19. I mean, I wouldn't call Hollow Knight chill, it definitely has chill vibes, but like, that game can get really damn stressful with combat. And you want, about to you want to talk about noises? The most horrendous noises I made. Like, easily one of the top three horrendous noises I made came from Hollow Knight.
Yeah, Celeste is a gem. I know it's not for everyone, because some people just don't like platformers they can get on the difficult side. And I mean, even me, I don't think I would bother so much with the B-sides. Like, I don't... It's like how I describe Super Meat Boy, like that game. I love that game, but some of the harder stages in that game, they're just beyond my skill level. And I'm okay with going, yeah, I mean, I'll try, but I'm not gonna destroy my hands over trying to get those levels done. But, yeah, I mean... Amongst all the other stuff I have planned, I just realize like some of the stuff I want to play is kind of recreating lost streams at this point, I guess. Particularly Tropical Freeze, like that's a game that I really want to replay again. Because enough, it's been enough time that I've kind of forgotten it. But I know it's a very good Donkey Kong game, and since we did play the Donkey Kong Country trilogy, I feel like it, it fits in pretty well. And it has such a great soundtrack. I use its music constantly in, in BRBs. Okay, so now it's just the scavenger hunts. So, uh, I would like to do more, but I need to leave it here for tonight, chat. It's getting very, very late. I just realized the time. It's probably a little bit later than I should have gone, but it's okay. Uh, since tomorrow's Tuesday, I don't typically have plans to stream, so a little bit extra today. Uh, but thank you so much for tuning in. Appreciate, uh, you guys hanging out and chatting. It was fun, as always. Hope the recorder music didn't get to you too much. <laughs> and if you're watching later on YouTube, thanks for sticking around to the end as well. Uh, yeah. Hope you've been enjoying the playthrough of this one, and if you do want to support the channel over here, the easiest way to do so is just clicking buttons for the algorithm. Uh, thank you to those that have done that. It does help out a lot. So, yeah. Thank you so much. Uh, also, I'm sure two other videos have popped up on your screen, so if you want to watch me play something else, these are the options that YouTube has provided you. Hope you check them out. Alright, till next time. Bye, YouTube.